Welcome to Agtron Enterprise's Legend install video. In the following video we will show you how to install our Legend system from the wiring, ECU and sensor components. We'll have a separate video to set up your tablet and Wi-Fi. Keep in mind that every model of Air Seeder is different and this example is best used as a guideline. Before you get started make sure you have all of your parts needed. Your kit will come with sensor loop cables. These are used to connect sensors together between each manifold on the drill. They come in 2 foot, 4 foot, 10 foot or 20 foot lengths. Next you will have your Y cable which is used to connect the first and the last sensor in the loop to your ECU or monitor head. These come in 10 foot and 30 foot lengths. Next you will have your main extension cables which are used to connect your Y cable to your ECU or monitor. These come in 10, 20, and 40 foot lengths. Finally, you'll have your ECU or monitor head and power source. For dual loop systems, where you have seed and fertilizer on separate lines, Make sure you install your cables and sensors one loop at a time. When installing the sensors, choose a spot 8 to 10 inches away from the manifold on the secondary hose. Once you've chosen the spot, cut it with a hose cutter. Once you've cut the hose, install the hose clamps on either side and insert the sensor into either side of the hose. The most important part of this is that you remain consistent in the distance between your cut and the manifold. Finally, tighten the hose clamps to keep the sensor in place. There's no wrong way to install a sensor. You can install it with the cables facing in or out. Once all your sensors are installed, you'll have to connect them together. The last sensor on each tower should have an open male end. That male end will plug into the female end on the extension loop cable which will run to the next tower. Once you run that into place it will plug into the first sensor on the next tower and you'll continue on from there. The next step is to install the Y cable. This will go in the middle of the drill. You'll notice there are two blue ends with arrows on them. Point the arrows towards facing the tractor. Once in place, use colored cable ties to separate loop 1 and loop 2. Yellow will be loop 2, blue will be loop 1. Then you'll run the male end of the Y cable to the very first sensor and the female end to the very last sensor. Once in place, your Y cable will go out 30 feet in each direction towards the first and the last sensor. If this isn't, enough, if this isn't long enough, use an extra loop cable to make up for the distance. The next step is connecting the Y cable to the ECU or the monitor. Depending on the monitor placement, you may need to use main extension cables to go from the Y cable to the ECU or monitor. Finally, the battery harness will run from the cab power back to the ECU. The best place to mount the ECU is a visible line to the cab so the Wi-Fi can maintain a constant connection as pictured below. Remember to repeat these installation steps for loop 2 if you are using a separate one. Thank you for watching our Agtron Enterprises Legend installation video. For more videos on setup and maintenance, check out our YouTube channel, Agtron.